Friends, thanks for checking back in. It is Eric and it's time for another quick tip for life on mission during this special series where we look at how can we as Christians live life on mission during this global pandemic? How do we care for people amidst self-isolation, quarantining, social distancing? So we're gonna look at another quick tip today, but before we do that, let me roll this bumper for you. Friends, my quick tip for life on mission today is creating a community directory. So for Leah and I, we're creating these little cards that we're gonna give to all our neighbors. We're gonna probably just tape them on the doors saying, hey, we wanna create a neighborhood directory where we can connect and contact one another just in case someone needs something. And so we got a little card that we're printing that just says, hey, would you email me or text me with your name, your address, your email address, your phone number, and then we'll send out a directory with all the names and addresses that we collect with people that are willing to help and want to be available to help and also let them know that if they have a need to reach out to that email chain. So that's my quick tip for you today. Create a community directory where you can care for your neighborhood. Maybe for us, we have four or five other Christians on our block and so encouraging them to step up and to help out um, during this time of need, especially for us, we have a lot of older people in our neighborhood. So being able to care for them, us younger Christians, being able to help out with toilet paper or flour or working on a vehicle or helping whatever it might be. So we're creating a community directory. And I wanna challenge you to create a community directory. It could be just a block, it could be two blocks, it could be three blocks. Maybe you've already done that. And, and that's super, super awesome. That's my quick tip for you today during this global pandemic. How can we love our neighbors? How can we live life on mission? And I think it's by connecting them to one another and letting them know that there's an outlet and a place that they can seek help. They can have their needs met um, through the church. So I want to encourage you to do that. If you've been encouraged by this video, would you like that button below? Be sure to subscribe to get more videos and check back tomorrow on Facebook and YouTube. I'm going to be posting another video of a quick tip for life on mission. Also, be sure to comment below let me know how you're dealing in self-isolation or social distancing but be sure to make sure it's positive and it's encouraging and hopeful for those reading and watching love you guys thanks for checking out this video we'll see you back here tomorrow